London hosts the Olympics and Thames Alive are appointed by LOCOG to organise the Thames-born torch relay on the opening day. The torch relay is a milestone for Thames Alive and one of its main objectives when it was set up in 2007. The company was formed to bring the River Thames into the forefront of London life and in particular the Olympic celebrations. On 27th of July at 7.30 in the morning, an invited flotilla of rowing boats congregated by Hampton Court Palace to accompany the Royal Row Barge Gloriana that was carrying the eternal flame from Mount Olympus in a cauldron mounted on her bow. The escorting flotilla selected by Thames Alive's director and water organiser for the event, Malcolm Knight, included the Royal Shallop Jubilant, Molly, an American whaleboat, Albatross, a Tay gig, Tiger, a Cornish pilot gig, Thames Waterman's Cutters, St George, Gordon Hall, and the Great River Race Jolly Boat, a Mark Edwards own design, recently refurbished for the occasion, the Jubilee Jolly. In addition, a range of the most treasured traditional wooden skiffs on the Thames from the Skiff Racing Association. The torch arrived, carried by Olympian Matthew Pinson. Torch's passage plan was for three distinct selections of rowers representing all the interests of rowing on the Thames. The first from Hampton Court to Richmond Lock and Weir. For the second leg, the sliding seat boats of the London Youth Rowing based at Chiswick and Putney. They rowed from Kew to Wandsworth. And then an escort of livery company owned Thames Waterman's Cutters from there to the Olympic rings moored off the City Hall. The flame was carried on board by a succession of bearers, and this journey was the penultimate one before David Beckham took it and its bearer in a speedboat for the final leg into the Olympic Park that night.